Hey guys, YOLO stream here, uh, stream tower, I mean, and today I'm gonna be doing uh, a world map, and I just would like to say this is uh, my favorite server so far because they have Skyward, uh, Hunger Games over there, and the world. So let's just start off with the world this day. Uh, so you basically right click it, and then the world comes up. But the first, the second they come in here, there's like fuck off new Britain down there. Mind my language. So as you can see, I'm on the yellow team. So the game is starting in three seconds. That doesn't mean the walls are falling. It just means that the game is actually starting in three seconds. Now the way I like about this game is that this map has so many players in it. Don't walk in the door. That um, if someone happened to like uh decide to uh run in a big bunch of players they will automatically uh oh come on I said don't walk in the door uh so that was stupid of them I should have just walked in picked up the redstone and the TNT but they rather destroy the whole place so basically what this is all about is you are just walking around and trying to mine, collect dirt, collect wood, and basically you have to try and sur survive. But uh, some see the walls are dropping in nine minutes. Which by that it means that in nine minutes the walls will drop, and every man has to try and survive. Uh, I'm not sure what happens till the end because I never survived till the end. I never like actually won. Uh, so for now, I'm just gonna try and survive. I'd be really lucky if I survived uh, while playing against, well, uh, recording this because that'd be just epic. So I'm just gonna pick up some food, some sugar, cane, some beef, some or pork chops, I mean, and some beef, and all sorts of stuff like that. I'm gonna hopefully find shears, or make shears, and yeah, my mouse broke, so I'm just using the little laptop thing, which is not gonna work very well. And I think, I think in every single uh, little quarter of the map, because the, the map is divided in four, I think every quarter of the map has an enchanted table hidden somewhere. So I'm gonna look for that, and you can see that there's another uh, place far off that way. There, you can cheat by breaking through the wall, but it's gonna take you ages because look how high the wall is. Unless you have a diamond shovel or something like that, it's gonna take you ages. Uh, what else is there? Yeah, there's not much to say about this, other than the fact uh, you can add me on Skype. Uh, you could follow me on Twitter, or you could uh, continue, or you could just uh, what's it called, or you could like my page on Facebook because I have all sorts of stuff like that. And uh, what else is there? Uh, seven minutes till the walls drop. So I'm just gonna keep playing until I die and stuff like that. There's not much to say. Um. For some reason, I'm not collecting any wood. Uh, maybe disconnect and try. Something wrong with that. Uh, see that? That's my friend's server. So, uh, hopefully you could join that and just have a few. See, as you can see, there's no one in there, but it's on a lot, and like just five seconds ago, my friend locked off. Oh, wrong. Server. Uh, so basically, what I want to do is make you want to join this server. Uh, so hopefully you will. And uh, sometimes you will lag because there's so many players. Sometimes you you can't collect stuff, and sometimes you can't break stuff. That's just the outcomes of uh, this. And you can also donate money and then ha be able to get a kit. Now. You could also find chests like this, and if you find chests, that means you can literally collect stuff from them, like 
for example, pickaxes and all that stuff. You can also die by zombies now and again because it does sometimes start off with as night time. Uh, while the game isn't starting, you can't get a head start by collecting stuff. That's the bad part. So you you could just go walk around and figure out. You could try and collect stuff, but it won't work because the game hasn't started. Now there's not enough players here, so that's why it's not starting earlier. It's 2 minutes 20. But if there's players, it will just go 10, 9, 8, and so on. It'll just Even though it's on like 5 minutes left, it will go on to... Uh, oh, I found a chest. So that way I got a head start there. I just know there's a chest up here. See what I mean? So people won't know that that's up here, and I think there's another one up there. And uh, 999, what the hell? Uh, so yeah. People are just doing stuff random here. What else is there? There's not much to say really. Other than the game starting in a minute and 40. So the second I die, I'm just out because with this, I can't really record the long enough. Uh, one minute twenty seconds left. Uh, what a jump? Um. By the way, there's chests all over the place, like I showed you two already. There's even one down here. But in that one, there's not much. All there is is a uh, iron sword, a bed, and a few apples. Not much in there. I'm not sure what's up in that tree. I just found that five seconds ago. And obviously everyone found that one that just like runs right from you when you start the game. So what I'm gonna do is uh gonna hopefully survive till the end. And if I can't, bad luck for me. If I can, that being so lucky. But I can this screen recorder only lets me record fifteen minutes. So, yeah, I can't really do much, uh, not much to, please, no, I fan, I'm just gonna read. So, even if you break the stuff during the time coming out long, uh, they, they'll all be there, they'll just restart, everything was reset, except then you start having life and all that stuff. So I'm just gonna go up into my little place I found a chest and collect the chest. Hopefully it's not um messed up and I can just collect it. Uh I'm not sure what that sign is by saying look for. So sometimes during creative if you break something it won't be there for the height limit. For building is 96. I'm not building up here, I'm just trying to collect this. Uh, what the? I'm not building. Something's wrong. Like, I can't die at all. I can't build or anything. <laughs> Someone's calling someone else a bastard. And so it's kind of funny. What the hell's going on? I feel like I'm not even in the server. Nothing's working for me. Like, I can't open chests. So that's one of the bad stuff about this um, uh, I'm not sure what to do because everything is broken and I'm just jumping into other people's places um, where is my team? I, I have no idea what's going on so that's one of the bad things about this I guess, um, servers. I'm just gonna jump around. 
Not, I'm just gonna show you this anyway. So basically, the walls will drop, and that will be there. This little place up here. And the thing that this is is um that th this is the only place you can barely find. You can basically find diamonds without having to mine. Now you have more of a chance of getting a diamond here than going off and actually um and actually mining for it. Now there's five stacks of diamonds. There's one there, one there, one over there, one at the top and one in the middle. So that's what basically happens. And you will be lucky if someone leaves the game. Like someone just did there. And the reason for that is that if someone leaves the game everything he has will be dropped and then you can have it. So then in these type of chests that are just left on here will be um will be with potions. And the guy put a lot of work into this map. As you can see, this is all for his walls. There's um redstone all over the place, there's glowstone. He broke all he put the whole place using bedrock. So uh, the least that you, you could do is give this video a like for him. Uh, if I was to just click that, that would basically ruin the whole clock, so I'm not going to do that. So yeah, this is basically what all the work he put into this. Uh, he even went out of the world just to make this. Uh, so yeah. I'm not sure what else I could say about this except give it a like. I'll probably get in contact with him because I know the the person who made this, and I don't know him in person, but I know his email address and stuff like that. So you can easily look him up. There's this website that if you want to get in contact with the person who made the server, it'll be on this on the website. So that's all I'm gonna say except just as my ending line YOLO uh, so like I said I'll work into this and give it a like comment and subscribe